Hi there, Darren from Darren T Fitness here. Um, thanks for tuning in to my Wrecking for Beginners series. Uh, this is part number three. Um, first off, um, this one I'll put a little disclaimer alert out there. Check with your doctor before you begin any exercise program, especially rucking. Um, make sure that you're make sure you get their clearance that it's okay for you to get out and exercise and all that good stuff. And you're healthy and and everything, and that it's a good idea for you to get out and, and move around with some weight on your back it can be dangerous okay um, so now that we have our we have our gear um, what's the next step well pretty much just put everything together and put your weight in your pack and get out and start walking um, you want to start I would suggest starting out with 10 pounds 5 or 10 pounds um, no more than 10 at first just to see how it how it is just go out for a short time you know, 15 minutes or 5, 10, 15 minutes, whatever you feel like, um, whatever you have time for. Um, um, yeah, especially at first you want to do that. You might be able to carry more. Um, I know I started out with 10 and then I I was carrying 20 with no problem. That was pretty easy to do, so, but I just kind of went up from there. Um, so I've kind of increased my distances um, over time with the lighter weights too. So that's what I would suggest is just increase your distances and go out for longer periods of time. Um, you know, start out 5, 10, 15 minutes, you know, to kind of work up because you don't want to overdo it or, or anything like that. Um, and hopefully you are hopefully you pick the right boots or shoes so if, <laughs> so your feet aren't, aren't hurting you out there. Um, there's a site called GoRuck, G-O-R-U-C-K.com. That's kind of the main site for the all the events and stuff at least the ones i i know about the ones i the one i went to um a couple weeks ago um it was a go ruck light event that i went to but that's kind of they've got a bunch of you can you can buy all the equipment there if you want to or like i said a sporting goods store um you can find you know pack there and and you know some stuff you need there um, um and no, I'm not affiliated with the GoRuck.com site, so <laughs> just to get that out there. Um, but basically, there's they have a bunch of list of events on that website too. Um, with the GoRuck Light, there's a GoRuck Tough, um, there's a Constellation. Now, there's, there's a bunch of the Challenge. Um, there's a bunch of different uh, different um, events that they have. So um, you you find something you like out there, uh, like the GoRuck Light. Is more of a kind of a, I call it an entry level beginner type um, event. That's what I went through. Um, it was still pretty challenging, pretty fun. I got got, got a good workout in on it. Um, even lost a, lost a few pounds while I was doing it. So <laughs> that's always good too. Um, but basically, like with the Go Rock Light event, you'll be doing other exercises when you go to the events. They'll have you doing different activities and stuff. You won't be just rucking the whole time. Um, I did we. At my event, we had to run around the park once, um, take a lap around the park. We did like things like bear calls and crab walks, um, buddy carries, the, the wheelbarrow up and down and back, um, like a dizzy run where you throw a run like 10 times in a circle with your pack and then you drop it and then you take off and try to run and you're staggered all over the place. They try to make it, it's, it's kind of fun. Now they try to make it fun for you, at least in the, the one I went to, um, the cadre did. Um, but we did that, and then we and we were broken down into like I think five or six teams. I think it was there was about six or seven people in a group and a team. I think it's all a team-based event, so it was kind of you were kind of competing against each other, and it was it was it was fun. It was more a competition. So every time some whoever would would lose, they would have to do things like push-ups or squats or just different things like that, um, flutter kicks, um, different things. They would whatever the cadre could think of it. At the time, I guess I think he had a list of things, um, and yeah, if you go out to YouTube, you can search out there for rucking too. Um, you definitely want to do some training before you go on some of these events. Um, I know I did some training before, um, but there's a video. There's some videos out there. If you just search Go Ruck um, training, you'll pull up all kinds of videos. There's even one from Go Ruck. Even on the GoRuck.com site, they've got some. Um, training type workout video workouts on there they show you guys kind of give you an idea what to do to to help you prepare for the for the rucking event but they're a lot of fun um it's a great way to get some exercise get out get some fresh air um and if you've got dogs 
like I said in previous my previous live, they'll they'll love it too. Take them out. Um, just make sure you've got water for them and for you. Um, but um, um, I hope you found this all useful and and helpful, um, at least a little bit. Um, if you did, or if you've got some constructive criticism or something, or you've got some other tips or something that I missed, go ahead and uh, let me know. Um, I'd like to hear from you. So thanks for tuning in and have a great day.